Happy, how are you doing? Oh, hey, what's poppin'? How y'all doing? What y'all doing here? I mean, I hear you're going on a solo tour. Yeah, actually, I'm um, getting ready to start my uh, my world tour, kicking off my my uh, the Asian, uh, not the Asian part. What are we What are we doing? Uh, we're, we're starting. Where are we starting at? Oh, in Australia first, actually, Australia? to promote the new single called "Whistle at It and Drip on Me." Of course. I mean, are you gonna be singing any B2K songs? That's a good question. I mean, why wouldn't I? So you are then. I mean, you know, I mean, it'll be better if it was me and all the guys, though. You know, right? Right. I mean, <laughs> will you be? I mean, if you do perform a song, which mm -hmm. you probably are, I mean, will you be like singing Omarion's parts on the song? Um, I would definitely sing all the leads. I can oh, hold it you're down. gonna sing all of his parts then? I mean, for sure. You gotta perform the classics if we are gonna do it, right? <laughs> I know. So a lot of people would ask. I mean, you're going on a you're going on a solo tour. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like you have something to prove, like going solo? Cause some artists do right. it. I mean, is that What's going on with well, that? Well, no, I don't feel like I have nothing to prove. I mean, it, this is just the era of Raz B. Mm, okay. <laughs> what about, I mean, I know a lot of people want to know, you guys have a loyal fan base. Yeah, is definitely. There, I mean, is there possible, like, maybe B2K reunion talks, like, anything? Oh, man, I mean, anybody that knows me, I'm, I'm the spirit of B2K, so I'm always trying to, you know, put something together. So, I mean, we'll see what the future holds. Is there anything you could give us, like, anything? We're talking. We're talking. <laughs> so no tour anytime soon, anything. I mean, maybe, I mean, maybe, uh, maybe the fans get something for Christmas. Oh, okay. I mean, I want to know, last year you were trending for some, like, uh -huh. behavior. Like, I mean, you was, like, scaling buildings and stuff. I mean, are you good now? Are I we... mean, oh, oh, you know. <laughs> you know what? Oh, I'm kind of like a little animal. That's kind of why I'm executive producing this new show for my boy L.A. Buck called Animal House. But, uh, uh, really, you know, that's more of a personal matter. Mm -hmm. Let's just say that they were mixing up some cocktails at broke my arm last year. They was mixing up some some strong cocktails, and I had to put the world on notice. Oh, okay. Yeah, I couldn't get a phone call in. <laughs> I need my phone call. But really, I'm um, I'm focusing on buying Roy's Royce today. You know, what I'm saying I'm about to ship this to Miami. Oh, okay. You're buying a Royce. Okay, which yeah. one you buying? It's already here. We already took care of the business. Yeah. Okay, so this is you, huh? Yeah, this is me right here. Yeah, yeah. Well, over the past few years, I've had the pleasure of producing a show called Bad Boys on the Zeus Network. Um, I've worked with and assisted other different OTTs. I know my brother Ray J is launching the Triumph Network. I mean, the, uh, oh, the, the Tronics Network. And I'm also launching the Triumph Network. You know what I'm saying? So just be on the lookout. Positivity, you know what I'm saying? Oh, and B2K Cares is my five, my 501c3. New vibes, you know, new energy, you know what I'm saying? Just moving on. Oh, and Harvey, I love you. Thank you for supporting me throughout the years, man. I love TMZ. I know. 